Hello guys, welcome back to Chris Poly channel. This video I want to share about limit AP info for all monster zone on Black Desert Online. Okay, to enjoy watch my video, make sure you turn on this video subtitle and also you can use timestamp that I already provide to go to target topic that you want. And if you haven't subscribed yet, don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on bell notification to get any update and guide on Black Desert World. Okay, let's start this video content using any feature that I provide. Okay, after 6 March 2024 maintenance update, Pribis just released new info about Epi Monster Chains. And this Monster Zone info update, you can find it on special user interface from in-game to show you about total stat for specific Monster Zone and also your character power. And to open this Monster Zone info, from in-game you can access it by pressing escape and on this new menu, you just need to go to adventures and then you will find this Monster Zone information. And this Monster Zone info window will appear that you can see any Monster Zone on any region on Black Desert. To get detail information for this specific monster zone, and after 6 March 2024 maintenance update, they just released this special feature to view total stat that you can click this rotation icon to show you more detail information for each specific monster zone. And if you hover your cursor on this menu, you will see any detail explanation for specific area that you choose. And there are some important information, especially for maximum AP limit for each monster zone. For example, that I show you on this screen, this is for normal Akman Temple. That maximum AP limit is 600, but efficiency when you grinding on this normal Akman Temple will decrease if your total AP higher than 600 point. And this decrease efficiency only will apply 70% of your exceeded AP that will apply on this monster on this Akman Temple. And each monster zone have different maximum AP limit that you can find all this information on this monster zone information. Okay, to show you and explain more detail how this maximum AP limit is work. For example, I will use my Kunoichi class at Sausan Garrison area that located at Media Region. As you can see, if you check your map, this Sausan located on this area, and if you click this icon, you also will open this monster zone information for those specific area. For example, this is Sausan Garrison information. And as you can see, if you reveal this detail information on this monster zone info, maximum AP limit on this Sausan Garrison is 280 AP. And decreasing efficiency for this zone is 0% for any exit AP that you have. So by this information, maximum AP on your character to defeat any monster on the Sausan Garrison is only 280 AP. And any exited AP that you have will not apply when defeating monster on the Sausan Garrison. So whatever AP that you have, if you hit any monster on the Sausan Monster Zone, only 280 AP will apply on this monster zone. Okay, for example, my total AP is more than 600 AP. And as you can see, this is total gear that I equip on my Kunoichi character. So if I try to hit this monster using normal hit, as you can see, I cannot one hit any monster on this Sausan Garrison with total 600 AP on this Kunoichi character. And next, I will try to reduce my AP on my Kunoichi character by unequip any accessory and also sub weapon that I have. But take notice, by unequip all this accessory and also sub weapon, this is not only reducing my AP, but also reducing my character accuracy. And as you can see, when I check on this monster zone information, when I see the tell information, my character stat AP is more than 300 right now. But as I already mentioned before, because I unequip any accessory and also sub weapon, this is also impact with my accuracy number. But this maximum AP limit on the Sausan Monster Zone only apply for your AP. And because on the Sausan Garrison have maximum AP limit 280, and any exceeded AP that will apply on this Monster Zone is 0%. So whatever maximum AP that you have. This is will limit to 280 AP only. And after I unequip my accessory and sub weapon, so I have less AP. As you can see, when I hit same monster, damage that apply on this monster is nearly same. But because my accuracy also got reduced, I think this monster bit talk 
because reduction of my accuracy from my accessory and my soup weapon, but overall damage from this monster zone still nearly same even I reducing my total AP of my character. And this is the reason why if you hitting monster on Sausan, you cannot one hit any monster on this area even you have very huge AP on your character. So if you find any monster zone and will apply 0% of your exceeded AP on that monster zone, I think to maximize grinding on this monster zone, you can maximize your accuracy instead increasing your AP to grinding more efficiently on this type monster zone. That you can maximize your accuracy by equipping any crystal that will give you high number of accuracy for your character. And if you need some recommendation crystal, you can check my previous video about updated best crystal after unification update either for PvE, PvP, life skill, experience, and any alternate character in your account. And make sure you check on video description for some additional info about any crystal recommendation on this video. Okay, we back to our experiment for this maximum AP limit. Previously, I show you about the Sausan Garrison that have maximum AP limit 280 AP and have 0% for exceeded AP that will apply. So this is mean whatever AP that you have, this is only will count 280 AP. And for another example, I will show you on similar AP monster zone, for example at Basim Base. As you can see, for example on this Basim Base, have maximum AP limit 213. But decreasing efficiency on this monster zone, is 70% from your exceeded AP that will apply when defeating any monster on this area. So this is mean, if your character have more than 213 total AP, this AP efficiency will decrease by applying only 70% of your total exceeded AP on your character. And for example, I will try to hit monster on this area with my full gear of my Kunoichi character that have total AP more than 600 AP. So because my Kunoichi character more than 213 AP, any exceeded AP on my Kunoichi character only apply 70% of them. And when I try to hit any monster on this Basim area with my full gear of my Kunoichi character, as you can see, I almost can one hit any monster on this area using basic attack. And when I try to reducing my AP by unequip any of my accessory and also my sub weapon, as you can see right now my total AP only more than 300 AP. So I just reducing any exceeded AP for 70% from this maximum AP limit. And when I try to hit same monster using gear that I already unequip, especially for my accessory and sub weapon, as you can see my damage just got reduced. And this is will significantly impact on your character attack power because this exceeded limit also still apply even you have huge AP on your character. So this is the reason why my character cannot one hit any monster on some monster zone because of this limit AP and also any exceeded AP that we have will not calculate as my character attack power. Meanwhile on some monster zone, the more AP that we have, we can one hit all monster on this area. So make sure you aware with this maximum AP limit, especially for percentage for exceeded AP on its monster zone. And the less percentage for this exceeded AP that will apply, the less contribute your character AP when defeating those monster. But if this AP limit have higher exceeded AP percentage, the more character AP that you have, the more power that you can get when defeating those type of monster. So make sure you check this monster zone information and check maximum AP limit from each monster zone to get better result when you grinding monster on this area. And next about how to read your character stat, especially for total AP from this monster zone. Actually total number that shown on this monster zone information on your character, this is total stat that already combined with any buff that you have on your character. Even for total stat that combine from extra AP against monster and any total AP and DP that you get from extra damage against specific type of monster. And if you want to know more detail about this extra damage, either for Kama Sylvian, Demi Human, Human, and etc., you can check my detailed explanation about logo beside monster health bar 
to maximize your damage against specific type of monster or player that you can find this video explanation on this video description. And additionally, after 6 March 2024 maintenance update, Prebis also implement increasing total HP monster if you dealing more damage with higher AP from this total AP limit and this increasing total HP of monster only will apply for several monster zone either on Abaddon Monastery, Tunkuta, Padix Island, Givin Rasia Upper Floor, Star End, Abyssal Sikraria Underwater Ruin, Histria Ruin, Trunwood Forest, Akman, and Kratuga Ancient Ruin. And this limit total AP is same as total AP that shown on Monster Zone information. So this is will make any monster on this list become more thick if you hit them using high AP. And if you want to know the total calculation from your character status that shown on this Monster Zone information, you can find more detailed information from in-game by open your character inventory and from this equipment window, you can go to this My Start button and if you click this My Start button, this special window will appear about total information about your stat and about explanation for this My Start window. You can find this detailed explanation about this My Start window on this video as second part for this video series. And by knowing where your AP coming from, you can maximize your character power from all this information. And you can check on this video description for this video link. And special thanks to all my membership for direct support via Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership. And also my current member, Dubia Dut, Doki, Angel, Ayrton, Snot, Soren, Afrilka, Elfamilia, Drunken Video, Jeff, S Gold member. And also for all my silver and bronze member, thank you so much for all your direct support. This is will make Chris Poly channel running and growing more faster. If you want to support me directly, I will very grateful. And as special thanks, I will put your name on my video depend on your support level. And be noticed at some level there are have some limit, so make sure you didn't get run out for this limited space. And I will put your name on every subsequent video that I release for the duration of your support. And if you want to join my membership to support me directly, you can go to any platform for Patreon, Karya Karsa, and YouTube membership. I already put link for this membership on this video description. Or you can check on top right of this video, I already put card for Patreon link. Okay guys, that's all about Monster Zone AP Limit. Hope all this information can help you to maximize your power on specific Monster Zone that you want. If you like this video, you can like and subscribe to my channel for another guide and update. Thank you for watching. See you next time.